is Diabetes Awareness Month, and the disease is becoming a big problem all over the country, with more than 5,000 people diagnosed every day. Anthony Humes joins us with more. Anthony? Diabetes has tripled in the last nine years in North Dakota, with 9% of people being diagnosed with either type 1 or type 2. Greg Workmeister has been a long-time type 1 diabetes sufferer. It sucks. <laughs> Quite frankly, it's hard. It's... Greg wasn't diagnosed till later on in life, and doctors weren't even sure what type of diabetes he had. At one point, I was diagnosed first when I was 39. Um, my blood sugars were 798 when I went in, and, that, and they thought it was type 2 then. Type 2 diabetes has become more common in society, and doctors believe it is due to the way we live. I think mainly due to our lifestyle. Uh, we live uh, in a world today where we, we rush and we, we go and we look for convenience and things. There are a number of warning signs to watch out for, such as blood vision, fatigue, and a number of others. Um, include uh, thirst. Some people might notice actually weight loss. Um, they might notice that they're uh, urinating frequently. Diabetes can also lead to a number of health issues. Um, it can lead to problems with the feet and the eyes and the kidneys, um, as well as heart attack, stroke. Um, so Greg has improved his lifestyle and doctors are happy with the way he is going. There is a cure for diabetes and 20% of American medical dollars are being spent on diabetes management. 